number seven. Oh my gosh, seven. It's been uh, pretty close to a full week of being on the pre-op diet. This is so crazy on how fast time was is going. I at first thought it was going by slow the first two days, um, but it just picked right up. And I think it's because I'm really keeping myself busy. Like today I went back over and I stayed over at the vacation Bible school that my kids are going to and I just hung out and took video. If you guys want to see that video, I have a second channel, um, Mom's Vlog 80. The description's in the box, in the description box down below. Uh, you can click on that link and subscribe to that channel as well if you're up to it. I do daily vlogs over there. Um, I've been doing uh, daily vlogs for almost a year now on that channel, so um, head on over there. Check out that channel if you want to see what's going on in our regular daily life and not just pre-op diet uh, updates. Anyway, I have all these papers. This is not even everything, but um, just, you know, telling me what I, sh you know, my schedule, what happens the first, second, third day during the surgery, fourth day. It even gives me useful phrases while in Mexico, like, Number one says, I am in pain, and it says, Tengo Dolor, which is in, uh, you know, Mexican, uh, more pain medication, please. Mas, oh God, medicamento por el dolor, por favor. I can't read Spanish, guys. Obviously, water, please, is easy. Agua, por favor. I need to go bathroom, etc., etc. There's a helpful guide to Spanish words if I have a Hispanic woman trying to take care of me. I could just see myself at going, hold on, uno momento, and trying to read what they said. Oh, como se siente? Oh, how do you feel? Oh, bien, bien. I know a little bit of Spanish. <laughs> Simplify your healing, it gives you tips and tricks. Here's one, I'm gonna go to a lightermeal.com and check out a 14 or 28 day nutritional support plan. I'm gonna go see how much it is. I don't know how much it is, but there's like a 14 day kit. It contains five cold drink flavors, two hot drink flavors, one to two smoothie flavors, 13 different pudding flavors, one chocolate wafer, one. Okay, I'm only allowed to have one in 14 days, all right. Four soup flavors and one veggie dough. Um, that must be closer after the two weeks. Or I can have the 28 day support plan which comes a lot more. So I'm gonna go check out the prices and I'll let you guys know um, if they're pricey or not or if they're good prices for kits. So each day I have a topic now on this list that I will be talking about uh, after post-op. I'm going to save it for post-op. So if anybody has a problem and I will be titling it like Let's say frothing. What is frothing? Well, um, I'm gonna name my title frothing, or you know, post-op day number, and then the title frothing. And what fro frothing is is like um, almost kind of like foaming at the mouth, but it comes from the inside. It's like mucus, but it's bubbly, kind of like foaming at the mouth. That's frothing. So I'll be talking about these. Um, there's a lot of topics that can keep me going for a few weeks. So, or a couple weeks, so I'll be able to do topics um, post-op, which is really cool. So, help relieve dumping syndrome, um, need more antibiotics and cleaning, and how to clean your incisions. And then it gives me what is good to use, like measuring cups, spoons, small plates, utensils, etc. Pill crusher, I already have one of those. Um, and then I got Primary source of nutrition needs to be 75% of all calories consumed, should be lean, protein-based. I'm using plant-based protein. That's the leanest you can get uh, for protein. So like, but you can eat at ProStop, you can eat eggs, cheese, yogurt, beans, fish, meat, and protein powder, etc. Um, that is your primary source of protein. A little bit of carbohydrates, uh, like Ross, uh, Ross rice and um, pasta and stuff, but only 15% of fats. Um, it should only be 10% of your calories. And then it talks about drinking adequate uh, amounts of liquids, etc. So this is very informative to me. Um, there's so much information in here. I haven't printed everything out, 
Um, but they, every day I keep getting a new email um, sending me something what I can do like avoid fibrous foods. That's more topics I could talk about. I know that a couple other people are pretty much on the same um, days, day before or day after that are getting the surgery. So I wish them good luck as well. I am watching their journeys on YouTube as well. Um, I will give them shout outs tomorrow. I don't have my phone in front of me to get their names. But uh, anyway, so that's it. I don't really have much to update. My weight's still the same. I actually gaining weight, even though I haven't really eaten anything today. All I've eaten was protein drink and maybe a couple of those chicken meatballs. I have chicken meatballs that are packed in protein. Um, the least amount of fat you can have them and I just microwave them and you know, they're this, uh, about this bug, uh, bug, big, I can't even talk today. So, um, anyway, so there's really not much for me to update today. I'm just going to say hi to everybody and, um, thank you so much for watching. Tomorrow will be day number eight. Tomorrow is the day where I start, um, where I can't have any medication. They restrict you from medication for a whole week because they don't want that in your system, thinning your blood out. Um, some medications do thin your blood out, such as aspirin. Bayer and all that stuff and if I take it for like a headache I'm gonna have to like sleep most of this stuff off because um, I do not want to have any risks happening so my worry though is blood clots my blood is too thick although I did have a gallbladder surgery removal and my blood was too thin but I don't know who knows so you can't have any medications for a whole week so we'll see how that goes I really didn't have anything this week I've, I've been feeling pretty good so not really anything this week. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't yet. Follow our, my journey. I have seven days till my um, surgery. I'm so excited and we will see you guys all tomorrow for day number eight. Love you guys. Ciao.